I've always taken part in clinical trials for as long as I can remember. Um, as a child, I, I didn't necessarily understand why I had to get on an exercise bike and go on it for 30 minutes while something was attached to me or why they wanted a breath sample. But uh, as, as I grew older, I began to realise the importance of um, medical research and clinical trials to directly benefit me. Well, I think it's survival thing, isn't it? You want to look after and, and a, a protective. You want to protect your children, and you do that in whatever way you can. You know, we wanted to protect our youngest because she was in the most vulnerable age group. You know, so that's why we did it. I just thought, well, it's only for three or four days, and it's going to help other people in the future, mm -hmm. and help um, my doctor because she's done an awful lot for me. Um, and she's always so supportive of me and now this is helping with her with her research so those are the reasons why I did it. Okay we'll give it a whack if it makes you better, it makes you better. Mm -hmm. There's no point of living away from a sofa or a bed where you can't move mm -hmm. to uh, mm -hmm. do nothing so let's try and see if this helps you out at all. And I think it was really good my parents because my parents let me decide. They didn't see it as it was their decision, not mine. They realised that I was mature enough and that it was my life I was playing with mm. and that I should be able to make that decision. So, you know, if they bring out a new drug, they're not offering it to you for, for no reason. Um, and they, they must really think it works to be offering it to you because they get in a lot of trouble if it doesn't. <laughs> and it costs a lot of money.